Assalamu alaikum dear students. Hope you all are well. Welcome to our today's BGS class. In my bag, you are seeing some pictures of some buildings. Here is the building of our National Parliament House of Bangladesh, the Supreme Court of Bangladesh and the Secretariat of Bangladesh. You may think why I am showing these buildings. Is this our today's topic? No students, these are not our today's topic, but the worker of these buildings and their works are our today's topic. So who works in these buildings? The member of parliament are works in the parliament house. The judges and lawyers are works in the supreme court. The secretaries, the ministers and some government employees are works in the secretariat. They all are the government employees and they work hard for running our government smoothly. And they have three organ and the, this organ has individual name. And our today's topic is these three organs. We will know about the name of the three organs and their works, the organs of Bangladesh government. Like every government, Bangladesh government has also three organs. In previous class, we already knew about the definition of government, uh, like parliamentary types of government, republican government. And we all know the Bangladesh government is a parliamentary system of government. And it has also three organs. First one is legislative, executive and judiciary. These three organs are work together. If we explain it with the example, like uh, legislative group enacts laws and th that laws implemented by executive group and our all laws are protected by our judiciary group. The legislator of Bangladesh is unicameral. Unicameral means it has one chamber and it has no provinces. And they uh, conduct their work from central government. And our legislative name is Jatiya Shangshod. And you already know who are the members of Jatiya Shangshod. Our Jatiya Shangshod has 350 members. From here, 300 members are elected by direct vote of general people and the 50 members are selected by those 300 members. And our executive group is the, our executive group works to uh, implement all of functions of the Bangladesh government. The members all government employees are the members of executive group and the head office of our executive group is the secretariat. The members of the judiciary groups are all of the justice and lawyers of Bangladesh are the members of judiciary group. They work for protect our laws and they ensure the pure judgment. explain the legislative group formation of legislative it has unicameral government it consists of 350 members here 300 members are elected by direct vote and 50 members are selected by indirect votes. The tenure of the parliament is five years. It has one speaker and one deputy speaker. They conduct the session of parliament. Functions of legislative
first work of the legislative group is enacts law and amends the general laws formulates and amends constitution yearly budget is approved by it it ventilates and expresses public opinion that mean they works with public opinion it is the guardian of our national exchequer that mean our uh, expenditure and uh, our uh, income is regulated by it next executive group formation of executive group employees who are entrusted with the safe state's functions that means all of government employees are the members of executive group from the village guards to the head of the state and do you know who are the head of the state the head of the state is our president and the head of the government is our prime minister both of them are the members of this executive group because they are the um, they are in the government employee functions of executive group actually the m main work is done by the executive group mainly they execute the law that law which is enacted by the legislative group and they maintain the internal law and all of the orders of the country or government they administer the country how can they uh, rule the country smoothly maintain relationship with foreign country they works for the defense for the liberty and sovereignty of the country and next judiciary the formation is consist of all judges and lawyers of the country the chief of this organ is chief justice who is appointed by the president Supreme Court has two divisions one is appeal divisions and another is high court divisions functions of judiciary they ensure impartial judgment it conducts and gives verdict of the cases it interprets the provisions of the constitutions it act as a safeguard safeguard constitution these all are the functions of judiciary group let's summarize the today's topic at first we uh, knew about the organs of bangladesh government and the formation of these three organs and the functions of three organs i hope you all are understand clearly please sort your worksheet and send me thank you very much students